is Johnny Vlogger, UK. And I'm in Seaford again. It's a bank holiday weekend, it's Sunday, and I thought I'd come over and see a few friends. I've got uh, Lucas here. Hello. And we're, uh, we're near Seaford Head. You can see the New Haven Ferry coming in there from Dieppe. Transmont Ferry. There's quite a lot of people here. There's a bit of cloud. We had a bit of sun. It's hoping that big, big uh, black cloud is going to miss us. Um, good old English weather. So we're going to walk up to the top of Seaford Head. We'll have a quick look over by the um, this little uh, whatever you call it, groin promenade. What do you call it? Like arm, maybe. Arm. There's quite a lot of people out, people fishing, sitting on the beach, walking, running, walking their dogs. It's um, just shows you the old lockdown is coming to an end. Um, people are making the most of it here in Seaford. People look happy. There you go, that's better. You alright? Mm. Are you talking to a woman? Yeah, no, I just wanted to know. Trying to chat a woman up? Yeah, obviously, yeah, of course. He's, he's good at chatting <laughs> women up, isn't you? Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's going to give me a few tips. <laughs> it's high tide today. I don't remember seeing the sea like this when I come here last time. There we go, look at that for a view. Look at those cliffs, that's amazing. Wow, we've got the seagulls sitting on those little pillars. You can see behind that little rock where a big chunk has collapsed. That must have happened nearly a year ago now, I think. Um, it looks quite recent though, doesn't it? People standing on that bit up there. They're risking it. I don't think I'd do that. If that suddenly collapsed, you'd know about it. So we are going to walk up. Um, up there, probably not near the edge, but we'll um, we'll have a go. So let's uh, let's move on. Okay, so my friend's gone. Uh, Lucas, he's gone up that pathway there. It does say do not pass. Be aware that chalk cliff falls are common in this area. So I'm going to walk round this way. We've got this big steep uh, brick wall here. So we'll go this way. We'll go the safe way. I'm not going to go that way. So we're going up here. Quite a lot of walkers and people keen to get up there. I did try this the other week but I gave up. It's too steep. Well, I've got a bit more energy today, so we'll, uh, we're going to give it a go now. This is a first. So that's the way up. If I stop and turn, you've got a lovely view of uh, New Haven. You can just see the ferry going in. It's quite a nice sight. And that green field, they had the fun fair there. That's on my other vlog. Seaford Part 3, if you want to watch that. Walk about. So, we're heading up here. There's Lucas. Look, he's on the other side of the fence. <laughs> Not sure if he can get over that fence. That'd be uh, interesting. Shall we walk over to the edge? I think he's. Can I'm not sure if he can get out. Oh well. I'll have to hurry up and speed up. Whew. Crikey! A few rabbit holes here. Look. People playing golf. 
near clubs in the ground. So as you can see, we're getting quite, quite near the edge. Christ. Look at that. You won't want to walk near there. That looks very dodgy. But people do it. Look, crazy. Look at that person going right near the edge. That could collapse at any moment. There's Lucas. Look at him. Okay. Onwards we go. I'll zoom back out. So it looks like there's some sort of uh, some restaurant over there. Bar restaurant. I can see people outside. Got the umbrellas and that. Benches. Maybe I'll go there in a minute for a little break. Like it's a golf course, that must be a golf club. All you keen golfers, there you go, that must be Seaford Golf Club. Or Seaford Head Golf, golf Club, maybe. Well, there you go, it's by Seaford Head. So we're walking up this, walking up this uh, hill. Still got quite a way to go. Seaford head right up the top there in the distance. This is a chalky bit. Looks quite uh quite dodgy. You alright? Yeah, you doing alright? Where you been? On the edge? Yeah, just checking out. Bloody hell. It's a bit blowy. Well, I might go on this bit, have a look on this bit. There's a massive crack in that cliff. That's not good. Look at that. Jesus. Oh, bugger that. Don't like heights. Bit scared of heights. Bugger that. Keep well away from that edge. There's a massive crack in that cliff there. That is definitely going to collapse at some point. Whew. Reminds me of... Uh, the Isle of Wight. Gotta make sure my phone's secure, don't want it falling over. Someone doing a photo shoot. It's a bit windy now. We're not even at the top of uh, here we go, look, that must have been where it's collapsed. You can see that big, uh, big chunk of pile there. Oh man, this is dodgy. Look at that. Keep well away from that. If you want to come and brave it yourself, good luck to you. But there's no way I'm doing that. I mean, this is just Seaford Head. Imagine what Beachy Head's like. It's even worse. This is just like a warm-up. Nah, sorry mate, I've got, I've got a fear of heights. When I, if I if I wanted to, I'd lay on the ground to the edge, but I wouldn't walk standing up to the edge. 
Colonel. Whew. So look at this, this soil, that, that's going to be very soft. You wouldn't want to walk on that. Get a lot of Chinese people around here. Japanese and Chinese, they love it. So you can see that crack in the cliff there. I'll zoom in, look, that chunk, that bit's about to go at some point. There's a seagull up there. Seagull nesting. I mean, look at that bit there, look. There you go, I'm going to film just over the edge. That. I wonder how often the uh, Coast Guard come here to rescue people or pick up people that have sadly died. It does happen, unfortunately. It's a shame, really, they can't stop this corrosion. You see a... Uh, that's like an old World War II gun... Gun... Uh, what do you call that? A gun tower? Don't know. It's got a little hole in it, isn't it, where they used to have the guns sticking out. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Little watchtower. <sighs> so we're nearly there. We must be halfway, aren't we? We're just over halfway now. Or to the top. Yeah. Where are we going? Just to where those people are then? Or? At the top there. Yeah, yeah, just over half. Yeah, over half. Is that a golf course at the top of the hill there? I think this is all a golf course, John. Wow, look at that. People playing golf on the top of the hill here. Maybe we'll have a look. Just hope we don't get hit by a golf ball. <laughs> Four... <laughs> if that was me hitting a ball up there, the ball would definitely come this way. I imagine you have to be careful that you can't like fall out here or whatever. So as you can see, the um, this pathway is quite a way inland. It's quite busy here. It's crazy. I've lived in Brighton all my life. 52 years and I've never been up this part, Seaford Head. Oh. I think YouTube makes you get out more when you do your vlogging. It makes you more adventurous. Yeah, true. If I wasn't doing this, I wouldn't be here now. I'd never, I still wouldn't have come here. Guarantee it. Go. A couple of little doggies. Danger golf. Balls in play. So that means we can't cross then there. Unless you want to get hit by a golf ball. Jesus, I'm knackered already. Yeah, he'll do that. This reminds me of climbing Mount Tidy. That shows how unfit I am. I'm not as fit as I used to be. Whoa. Where's it gone? God knows where that went. Oh, there it is. You can see it going down the hill there. It's quite a steep ramp to be pushing your uh, golf clubs down, isn't it? 
I can see a plane coming. There's a seagull. Flying quite low, but then we're quite high up. Whew. So that's obviously uh, a certain hole where you tee off. We're getting higher, Whew. so you can see the incinerator in New Haven from here. Oh. You can see all of Seaford, there's quite a lot of houses here. Got the South Downs in the background, nice view. Lots of people walking, sitting down, admiring the views. So I think we're there now. <sighs> Is this the top? They've moved this fence in more. Obviously it's a bit dangerous here. Let's see if he pots it. Will he pot it? What do you reckon? Ah, oh, close. Nearly. That was a shame. Wow, look at that, we can see the Seven Sisters from here. I didn't know that. There you go. That's an amazing sight. So we'll film this bit and then we'll stop. So that's a... Uh, a mission for another day. Go to Burling Gap from Beachy Head. Well, some people do actually walk from here all the way to Beachy Head. It's um, quite a long walk hike, but it can be done. It takes about six, seven hours, I've been told. So we're at the top of Seaford Head now. As you can see, um, there's massive cracks in the, uh, all this could go mate, I'll be very careful, look, look at this, look at that, it's going to collapse, 
goes, it goes. Wow. So this is on its last legs, this bit of land. This will probably be gone in the next year or so. Get a big storm, a few droughts, and it'll be gone. I would imagine it vibrates a lot before it collapses. I'm sure you get some sort of warning, don't you? Uh, I don't know. Or it'd be like uh, it'd be like one of those action films, wouldn't it? When you've got to leg it and do a massive jump. <laughs> Well, like I say, I've never been up here before, so this is um, an experience. Oh. Gigantes. Right, so that's the top. And now I'm half blinded. There's the Seven Sisters. So that's uh, a nice view of the Seven Sisters. Okay, we're going to end it here. So thanks for watching. See you next time.